There was once a potato. Her name was Mrs. Potato. Her life was so perfect. She had, she was pregnant. She had a husband. And she had parents. This is her husband, Mr. Potato. Mr. Potato and Mrs. Potato would always go out on a dinner date. They would always hug, they would always take pictures, they would always kiss. They just loved each other so much. But, unfortunately for Mrs. Potato, everything changed. So one day, her and her husband were going to the movie theaters. And it was about two years after they had met. They were going to go watch The Sweet Life on Deck. So they did. They went to the movies together. Then, when they got out, things did not go so good. Miss Potato had divorced Mrs. Potato. Mrs. Potato was so sad. She didn't know what to do. She just didn't want to live anymore. She didn't think she could live without her husband. Miss Potato was just so sad. So she locked herself in the room and started to cry in her pillow. <coughs> My husband died. I don't know what happened to him. Miss Potato Head was so sad that she couldn't she didn't even want to tell her family. She thought her life had gone apart. So, she committed suicide. First, Miss Potato had tried to hang herself. But fortunately, the tape ripped. Then, Miss Potato tried to drink Clorox. But her stupid ass had just remembered that there was nothing in the bottle. So then, Miss Potato finally decided to go on the web and search up reasons of how to kill yourself. So then, Miss Potato had decided that she was gonna squish her head in the concrete. She later died of her injuries. Once upon a time, in a faraway land, a potato gave birth. <coughs> Junior Potato had a hard time in school. He didn't get along with the other oranges. Watch where you're going, fat ass! Potato would often get bullied because he was such a small bitch. Die! Die! But he knew how to hide away from them. He would always run to a secret space behind the orange cartons. Junior Potato always had one friend that he could count on. But she died! Junior Potato made a new friend. She was she lived in the apple line. Her name was Miss Applehead, but she was her best friend and had many adventures together. Like the time when they went to the, the palm tree and had a wonderful time. They went many places together and they had a fabulous life. life. They went many places together and they had a fabulous life until Miss Applehead died. Ever since Junior's but mom died while giving birth to him, he moved in with his grandma because they were so poor that they lived in a nest tea can. They lived in there for most of their life. It was a very sad place for them to come home. Inside wasn't that much either. One day, Junior's potato Potato Grandma died of Applehead disease. And Potato went moving on and lived in the big city. 
or like he used to call the giant ass apple. Junior Potato loved his new place. He had cane, sugar, Nutella where he could dip chocolate in, and he had a bunch of toilet paper that would last him a life. He had many types of garlic salt when he went on to make fries, and he had many different types of friends. He had chamomile tea, one of his best friends, and and Little Blue, and George Washington as one of his friends. One day, Junior Potato had a job interview to be the new organic guava, but he failed and committed suicide. He tried many ways to commit suicide, but failed. Until one day, he decided to jump off the stairs of death. He loved his life. No, he hated his life. Nothing was worth it. So he jumped and committed suicide. As he always planned.